a series of allegorical fountains decorate the old town. Most were inspired by classical mythology. This one, featuring Julius Caesar, is dedicated to the legendary founder of the town. The modern turtle fountain is a popular meeting place for young mothers and a fine place to watch toddlers enjoy the art. This astronomical clock was destroyed by the Nazis in World War II. Today's version was rebuilt in 1953 by the communists with their kitschy flair for propaganda. In good social realist style, you have earnest chemists and heroic mothers rather than holy saints and virgin Marys. In this region so rich in agriculture, these symbols of the 12 months each feature a seasonal farm activity. High noon is marked by a proletarian parade when the mechanical conga line of milkmaids, clerks, blacksmiths, teachers, and first defenders are celebrated as the champions of everyday society. As with any full-service astronomical clock, there's a wheel with 365 saints, so you'll always know whose special day it is. And this clock comes with a Moscow-inspired bonus. Red bands splice in the special days of communist heroes. Lenin died on the 21st day of the year. Stalin's saint was Thomas, day 355. We can't leave Olomouc without experiencing one of the city's greatest attractions. It's notoriously stinky cheese. So we all know about the great Czech beer, but what's with this famous cheese from Moravia? Well, the Olomouc Tvarushki yeah. <laughs> well, is the stinkiest cheese in the whole country. <laughs> and uh, Really? If there's one thing you associate with Olomouc is this cheese. <laughs> My mom, who comes from this region, when I was a kid, when she would start eating this at home, <laughs> Me and my dad, we just clear out the kitchen. So the, the thing that makes this cheese is the way it ages. It ages on the aged meat. So the meat itself has to be aged to age this cheese. And, and then you have to age in order to learn to like this cheese. Now what are you putting on it? That's young onion, young strong onion. And why is that important? It's good for you as a man. <laughs> Stings, that's good. And what is this? These? These are really strong mints. <laughs> so you can go and kiss your wife when you go home. <laughs>